setting the torch up for our first actual welding project and that will be welding coupons in the 16 gauge. Uh, so we're going to use the zero Victor tip and set it up, secure it snugly to the welding torch. And remember in this case we're going to set our pressure on 3 psi for acetylene and 3 psi for oxygen. To set the acetylene pressure let's start by opening up our tank back off our valve. Open this valve about one half a turn. You can hear the gas flow there. Close it off so we don't waste gas. We'll drain that hose down to zero on this side. Back the diaphragm off completely. And remember we said that we we're going to set this for 3 psi. So with the valve closed and this opened approximately, remember, on the acetylene side we're going to open the valve about one turn and that's it. Diaphragm's backed off. We have pressure in the tank. We have pressure from the tank reading on this gauge, nothing on this side. We're going to open this valve up slightly, that's the acetylene valve, about a half a turn. And the reason I'm going to do that is I want to stabilize the pressure at 3 psi. So I'm going to gradually turn this up to 3 psi. You can hear the gas going. Turn it off. You notice it jumped up slightly. Open it slightly. Back the diaphragm off. And when I close that, it jumps up slightly. I want it at 3 psi. That's about right there. That'll work for the acetylene side. And now we'll set the oxygen. Remember we're going to open this valve. First we'll back the diaphragm off. So we have zero on this gauge and we'll open the oxygen up fully until we seat the oxygen valve fully out. That's our goal here. Again we have pressure reading on the tank side. Nothing reading on the torch side because the diaphragm is turned loose. And we'll gradually We'll gradually open the diaphragm and again in this case we want 3 psi. It's about right there. Again we'll crack the oxygen valve just slightly and make sure that that pressure is stabilized with the oxygen on. About right there will work fine. And we're ready for our first welding task the next session.